Hi there guys, um, in this video I'm going to show you how to edit a video and um, you know render it out of um, Sony Vegas Pro 9. So I just made a test video before by using um, the Camtasia Studio 7 and um, they're just, they're just a little test video, um, wasn't much as you can see it goes on for about 20 seconds. So um, something like that, yeah 20 seconds. So um, as you can see over here, it's just all it is is just moving the mouse around. Can't really see that at the minute, and then it opens um, the internet up, and so on. And as you can see over here, it doesn't look the best. If you want to get it to the best, you're gonna go click this preview, click best and full. And as you can see, it's obviously changed a lot better now. And um, yeah, so um, yeah. <laughs> Um, as you can see at the side, how see how it cuts off here. Um, you can right-click on this and choose properties, and you can reduce the main access ratio and loop. And now click OK, and as you can see, it spreads it out. So now that's full screen. Um, once you click here now, you can see it in full screen. So yeah, um, that's doing good. Um, and there's a lot of things you can add into um, videos. You've got your Video effects, your media trans uh, generators, um, your transitions. So uh, I, I, you can see, I got the new blue effects. Um, they cost not that much. Um, so go check them out. You can get absolutely load of stuff. But with the basic ones, there's still quite a lot of stuff you could do. You could have this simple. Um, if you just drag down and put it onto the the start, it'll it'll ask you all these settings. So I just want to keep them the same. You can zoom in here by clicking down here. And you can just maybe spread it out a bit. Um, but click in there. So I watch now. Oh, oh, that's the trouble about putting it in best. Sometimes if you just put, sometimes just put it in preview and auto, it works a lot better. But did you see how that comes in? Fades in there. Um, so yeah, you can use stuff like that. Say right at the end here, I want to fade it out. I can use a fade offset by just dragging on the end of here. As this comes up, you can just drag down. So if I watch now, as you can see, it fades out slowly. So that's another smart thing. Um, oh. You can um, say if I don't want the audio, you can just click click on it. Um, this is the way I do it, because it'll be attached to this. I go and right click and click new audio track, and then drag up, and then delete this one, and then I can go along to, uh, I don't know, just, you can go add some music in, so you can have your music. Uh, so as you can see, we just got this now. And say down here, as soon as I come to click on the um, where is it? The internet. Say I want to zoom in on that. You can come along here and choose this here, the event pan forward slash crop, and it brings up this thing here. And so as you can see, it. All right, there I am. I'm clicking on it now. I don't know why my mouse isn't showing up. <laughs> Bit stupid, but I can zoom in. So, oh, I'll do that. Um, so I can zoom in, take it to the corner, it's perfectly on, and then it'll be zoomed in there. And then, as soon as the internet pops out, I can just click here again, and that all that does is make sure that it doesn't zoom back out because sometimes it does do that. So then, say here I want it to come back out, I can just take it back out. Like that. So say, say if you're editing a Call of Duty video or whatever, and you've had an ace kill, and you want to zoom in on the person's name, this is how it will happen. See how it's zooming down here slowly, and you can also mess around so it doesn't do that. As you can see, it stays, and then it comes back out. So that's a another really smart feature. I know it's a little bit blurry, but it doesn't really matter. And um, yeah, so you can also say if I want some text above this, I can drag, I can click a new. Um, video track, make it to the top. I can um, I can right click and choose insert text media, or I if I want some different ones, I can go to media generators, choose text, and I can choose any of these. So I'm just going to choose this text here now. So I'm just going to edit this text. Um, I'm just going to put it say. Um, uh, you know, or no, not that. Maybe just like internet. 
you know, so I don't really know what you'd put. Say if you, you, you absolutely, what's the word, um, rape someone on, online on Call of Duty or whatever you want to say. Um, you could, you could do that. Um, so say now, it zooms in, and then when it reaches, it reaches it, it can just go, you know, internet. As you can see, I faded it in and faded it out. So yeah, that's a smart little thing. Um, what else have we got? In Vegas. Um, well, yeah, you've got all these things here. You, you've got sort of gradients. You've got credit rolls. So at the end, say if I want to add a credit roll, as you can see, it'll ask me to change the title. Um, let's see. And then I. Um, where's this text now? Um, I don't know what you could write. Let's just see what this looks like. So as you can see it comes up and then you'd have them and then thanks for watching and you know anything like that. It's a little bit slow at the minute but then yeah, it's on the preview auto if you make it on best it probably look a bit better. So look now. See? Yeah, it looks a lot better. And that's what it would look like when it's finished. So I can take it so it goes right to the top. Or is right to the top until it goes off? About there. Yeah. So you can do stuff like that. Um, you can fade it in. So you can comes in fading in. And there's a load of other stuff like that. So yeah, you can. There's a load of things. Go check them all out. You've got you know all your your flash. You can add a flash right at the end. Say here. So as you can see now, it flashes and then on it goes. Let's stick it down. So yeah, I've got a flash right into there. So that's so smart. You've got um, other all stuff. Then you've got your video effects. You've got all blurs. Um, you got light rays that I showed in another tutorial how to do light rays with the text. Um, there's loads, but so yeah, this this is what I want for my video. I'm gonna go up to file, render as, and this is how you get it out. And if you go check out my video on how to get the HD um, YouTube Best HD for it, um, you can go get it, and then you can just add. Say I'm just gonna put this as test, and then I'm just gonna click save. And it will start rendering it. And depending on how long the video is, if you've got music, if you do, I know all I know is Call of Duty videos, they take absolutely ages, but you don't have to do it in HD and you can be patient. As you can see over here, it is um, rendering it and so and so. And also down the bottom, it does say here and it will tell you your time. So, so it says there, I've got 10 minutes left. It's actually pretty slow, but then my computer is slow at the minute. But, um, yeah, there's so much stuff you can do with Vegas. Um, it's very good software. Um, yeah, you can add pictures in. You can do whatever. So I'm gonna be back when this is finished. So back in a sec. As you can see now, guys, um, we're nearly finished the rendering. So um, yeah, once it's finished, it will be wherever you've saved it. Mine takes me to my desktop. So as you can see here, it's it's come up as um, a test. So I can just open this up. I'll open my Windows Media Player because I did it with the um, right thing. And as you can see, here we are. It's in HD. Comes down here. I don't know where my mouse is gone. For some reason, my mouse isn't on this. So, um, and then I go onto my YouTube. For some reason, I don't know why my mouse is gone. Um, see that internet pops up there. I just look at the quality. Really good. Really good. Um, then I come out and then you see it flashes into this now. And, you know, there's so much stuff, um, really good. So, you can have a mess around with Vegas. I've, I'll tell you, you'll find so much really good stuff, and you'll get the hang of it really quickly. So, um, thanks, guys. Yeah, if you could subscribe, that'd be ace. So, thanks, guys. More coming videos in the future.